Meanwhile, the country's rail agency is under immense pressure. A second law firm is threatening to withdraw its services to passenger rail agency Prasa over unpaid fees. Prasa owes Cliff Decker Hofmeyer more than 9 million rand. There have been reports that Vaxman's attorneys was also dumping Prasa as a client over an unpaid 19 million rand bill. Prasa was placed under administration last month after the board failed to execute its duties properly. ENCA's Lindsay Dendlinger has the story. 45 days in the job, and administrator Bongisizwe Mpondo has the mammoth task of putting Prasa back on track. His job includes finding money to pay its service providers. Prasa is not in a good financial state, so that's not a secret. You just need to go read the annual reports. It's there. It's public information. So we're not generating enough revenue to cover our expenses. But legal firm Cliff Decker Hofmeyer says it's time to draw a line in the sand and put all work on hold. It's owed 9.4 million rand, excluding work in progress and not yet billed. The firm says it was promised payment of half a million rand in December, but it was never received. The firm has also made payments of more than 2 million rand on behalf of Prasa and says it can no longer act as a banker and financier. We do our best to try and meet our commitments and where we are not able to we communicate. We have communicated to all our suppliers, by the way, in the past two weeks um, to indicate our uh, precarious uh, position, uh, which again is not a secret. While Cliff Decker Hofmeyer has confirmed Prasa is a client, it says it's unable to comment further. Prasa too has declined to comment on the letter. Lindsay Dentlinger, Cape Town.